next guest is a very beautiful actress. She's in a new film, Hyde Park on the Hudson, in select theatres nationwide from December the 21st, the Mayan Apocalypse. <laughs> uh, she and I have a bit of history. Um, I think I'm giving nothing away when I say Rotterdam Bugler. <laughs> Please welcome the lovely Olivia Williams, everybody. Olivia Hello, Olivia. Still ripping up those questions. Yes, I don't need <laughs> cards to ask you a question. Like, how are you? I haven't seen you in a while. I'm really well now. What, what happened? Well, yesterday, and the day before, and the day before that, I was mud wrestling in a lake in Atlanta with Arnold Schwarzenegger. So, <laughs> now I'm really good. What, what, why? Was it for a film or just uh, is it a thing you yeah. do as a celebrity? Arnie and I like to do. No, uh, it was for a movie. It was, yeah? They didn't pay me enough, but uh, yeah. It was, it you was, couldn't pay me enough to mud wrestle in a swamp with Arnold Schwarzenegger. I, I, actually, you could. I'd do it for about ten bucks. <laughs> well, it wasn't much more, but yeah, that's so. I'm better now. No, you, you look great. Your hair's very short. I haven't you seen your hair this short ever? No, no. It was like this when I was about fifteen. Right. So I think I'm trying to recapture. I just want to look more like you, Craig. No, no, no. You. <laughs> I'm getting there. No, you're getting nowhere near it. Thank goodness. <laughs> Why have you got your hair so short? Are you...? Um, it was actually a bit of a, I want to be 15 and why can't I? Um, when I was at drama school, they, they told me short-haired women only ever play lesbians. And I think, <laughs> now I'm... <laughs> You've got to roll them up there. Well, uh, say, look... Now I'm 44, I'm yeah. thinking, you know, that's, they're, they're getting all the good jobs. What, and, lesbians? Yeah. And, so now I want to, I'm just going to go with that. I, I like it. I think it's dramatic. I was playing an, an astronaut and, you know, they were like shampoo. An astronaut? Yeah. I was... With Arnold Schwarzenegger no, in a that's smart? A that's a different one, yeah. yeah. And, uh, you know, I thought all the curlers in the goldfish bowl and in the rocket, you wouldn't... You have... researched this yeah. part very, very... Uh, very uh, <laughs> yeah. Curlers in the rocket? Yeah. No, you don't want that. That's no. like a Rotterdam bugler. It, it, I, uh, <laughs> We haven't, uh, we haven't danced in a long time. No, we haven't. No, remember, remember that was fun, wasn't it? We did, we did, we did some good moves. We did, and then there was the dancing when we were on the film. <laughs> hey, hey. You're making Ooh, me blush Yeah, again. a little bit of blushing. Yeah. <laughs> of course, things are different now. Very different. Yes. <laughs> well, we're both married and, yes. you know, and children. have children. And, and, yes, yeah. and all that. How's that? That's great, great. How is it for you? Very good, yeah. Good, good, good. Five and eight, going to school. Missing the Christmas play, Bad Mother. What? Yeah, You're I Missing know, the Christmas I know, play? I know, I know, but I'm, you know... Earning a living. Here, yeah. Right, yeah. Paying for the Christmas well, Would you play. like me to perform some kind of Christmas <laughs> play for you? That would be weird if you were trying to be my child in some way. I think that's... <laughs> Crossing boundaries that we probably shouldn't cross. Again. <laughs> Again. Yeah. No, we, pro we probably shouldn't. So, uh, how are things in London? Everything uh, yeah, jolly good? I don't know. I've been in Atlanta. Oh, yes, I'm... of course. Yeah. Hey, did you like Atlanta? I did, actually. How the traffic like strange? Didn't notice that. Weird. Don't know, how, don't know where to go with that one. No, I just made it up. Okay. I, uh... They're not strange. Uh, no, a really great city, though, you know, birthplace of... Martin Luther King, I did a bit of, you know... Did you? Yeah, I did. Went, went to his birthplace and paid my respect there. I, I thought it was a great city, really uh, integrated city. I thought it was... Did lovely. you... Uh, have you ever been to Washington? As in D.C.? Yeah. Yes, I have. It's nice there, isn't it? Yes, I... It's quite I was... far away from Atlanta, but yeah. I thought I'd bring it up. <laughs> that one. No, I went from there, I went to Nashville, which was fantastic. Oh, I love Nashville, yes, I do like it there. Yeah. And also in Nashville. Yeah. I... Uh... <laughs> And uh, I went to North Carolina. Oh, that, you're getting around. Do you have an RV? Are you going around with... <laughs> with Ed. Uh, yeah. yeah, yeah, Ed no, and just... Mrs. Boyd. I am known <laughs> by my friends as Guidebook Gertie. Wherever I go, I've got a guidebook, and I read it, and I go and visit things. So mm. anything you need to know about the Atlanta area, I can help you with. No, I'm good. <laughs> I, uh... <laughs> What's the uh, film about that you're in, this one? This one, Hyde Park on Hudson. It's um, about a weekend when uh, the royal family came to visit the Roosevelts in their house in Hyde Park. Oh, uh, do you play someone English? No, I don't. I Good play... for you! I play... 
I play an American. In fact, really? I play one of your first ladies. I play Eleanor Roosevelt. I was going to say Eleanor Roosevelt. That'd be yeah, perfect for I you. I was yeah. very, very, very uh, honoured to play one of the greatest women of the 20th century. Yeah. Did you know she wrote the Declaration of Human Rights? Yes. Yeah. Good. I thought you did. <laughs> Was that one of your citizenship questions when you no, became this American? No, well, well, they changed it. When I became a citizen, it was super easy. The right. question was easy. It was like, you know, do you like gum? Do you hate Al-Qaeda? And you come. But, they, <laughs> but, they, uh, but it's harder now. Like, people are, like, standing at the border with pencils, trying to work stuff out. I was yeah. like, woohoo! Yeah. I'm in. Yeah, exactly. Saying who wrote the Declaration of Human Rights? Yeah, well, I would say now Eleanor Roosevelt. Well that would probably be You'd my be right. answer. Yeah. yeah. Are you still doing the uh, hot yoga? I am. I did. Really? It, I did it this morning. I feel I'm, I might be repeating myself, but yes, oh. I did it this very morning, and I was trying to persuade Arnold to do it because he's having trouble with his knees. But um, oh, that's the least of his worries. <laughs> yeah. He didn't fall. Oh, right. my knees are the. <laughs> Jeff, could you say, as Arnold Swords, my you knees are the. do this new move called the Oslo Tatler. You'll love it. <laughs> I can't believe you didn't introduce me to your. Oh, friend. sorry, uh, uh, Jeff, this is a. Yeah, little... how are you? I can stop okay. talking like this now, yeah. <laughs> Tell me, Jeff, what's your dieting secret? Because obviously I'm missing out. Oh, it's very simple. It's uh, death. <laughs> It's kind of a Jungian thing we have here, you know, the mocking presence of death the, to remind me that this is all transient and that, uh, you know, uh, ratings don't count. Right. <laughs> it's obviously working. Yeah, yeah, it works for me. And then, of course, we have the horse over here to I'm remind me that, you know, life goes on even in the wintry wonderland. <laughs> See, the two greatest compliments I've ever been paid on set was once by a wrangler and he said, you're a good horsewoman, Olivia. That's a big thing for yeah. these guys. These guys don't normally talk. They don't talk Isn't at it? all. No, that was the first like... and last thing he said to me. And, um, and then Arnold said that I had <laughs> amazing intercostals, which I thought, for a former Mr. Universe, is, you know. Two things. Uh, first of all, <laughs> I don't know what an intercostal is. I thought it was a waterway in Florida. No. What is an intercostal? <laughs> it's a muscle that's sort of there. You do have amazing intercourse. Thank you very much. Yeah. Oh, well, I just, I brought that up because of the Bikram yoga, that, you know, credit to Bikram. Oh, yeah, right, right. So that, you, you still do the Bikram, you get the hot and bendy yeah. and stretch. and right. amazing intercourse. Hey, will you watch it with a potty <laughs> mouth, please? Coming I... from you, Craig Ferguson. I've known you a long time. It's yes, the first you time you've ever told me not to swear. No, that's not entirely true. <laughs> I don't think I said to her, I was like, shh. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you were winking at me. Yeah, time. well, I was like, shh. <laughs> All right, uh, do you want to have a quiet moment for ourselves? I'd love to. All oh, right. Should we right. exhale in a yeah, yeah, sort of yogic yeah. way? Yeah. Don't do that. Uh, so much time has passed now, Olivia, really. Yeah. <laughs> well, you know. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> Am I supposed to speak? I don't know. I don't know how it goes with this thing. I don't either. We just started it. <laughs> I think everyone's getting a little uncomfortable how long it's going on, and that's... <laughs> that's just when I start to shine. <laughs> I keep thinking about my packing. I'm sorry. You're, pa yeah. you're packing? Yeah. What, what, what packing? Oh, I'm going back to England tomorrow, and oh. there's three months' worth of Atlanta wetsuits to fit in a suitcase. And well, you've totally blown the moment. <laughs> Thanks a lot. <laughs> Love your words, everybody. We'll be right back. Oh, look at that view. You must tell me about everything. <laughs> 